Well, good afternoon. Uh, another quick video on the board. I just noticed it looks like it's a bit warped, but um, I took the board out of the the uh, enclosure and I gave it a good clean down. It does look a lot cleaner. Um, there's still some corrosion and stuff like that. Like if we zoom right in, let's see if we can get it to lock in. You can see here are the traces. You know, I missed uh, this guy here. But on some of the other things, like, you know, it, it cleaned off a, a fair bit of the gunk. Um, so it looks like, you know, that uh, you can see all of the solder mask peeling off in various places, like over here. Uh, if we have a look underneath the uh, board, uh, you know, you can see that it's all you know, gone crazed and lifted off. Um, the things you can see, there's vast arrays where the solar mask has come off. But overall, I think the board got a you know a fair bit cleaner. And uh, I'm going to use uh, a little bit of uh, lacquer. I bought a, a you know MG Chemicals pen that should let me re coat the uh, the solder mask. So let's uh, zoom this back out. And what we'll do is we'll plug it all back together just on the, the bench here and we'll see if it actually um, uh, see if it actually will do a uh, still work with the drives. Okay, well, I ended up putting it back in here because powered it up and it didn't uh, run and I thought maybe there's a, a ground that I you know was one of the screws or something like that um, and then what I realized it was was that uh, I had forgotten to put the uh, ROM back in uh, I took that out when I was cleaning it because I didn't want to damage the package but now uh, it should boot up and we can see the little light uh, come on I can hear the drive searching. The little light's gone out, so that indicates that the self-test passed. All right, let's try and initialize uh, comma 700 comma zero. That should be this guy. Yep, and now its light's gone on. I heard it. Uh, suck the drive out and now we'll just switch straight over to drive two and it's finished as well so board still works I think I was thinking about what I might do is uh, go put some of the components in some rust removing solution that I have uh, that does a fantastic job. I've used it on old uh, hand tools. Um, but I have a bunch of these things. The mechanicals all look the same. So I think what I'll just do instead is I'll find the best fan, I'll find the best IEC uh, input filter, the best case, and then I'll just transfer the board and the drives over to that and uh, just go from there. Anyway, uh, uh, when I get my lacquer pen uh, on the weekend, I'll do the, well, the solar mask pen, I'll do the solar mask. We'll do a, a quick video of what the final board looks like. And uh, then I'll seal it all up and get ready to use it. Anyway, hope you found this interesting. Catch you later. Bye.